Hi everyone, my name is Kelly and welcome back to my channel. It's been a very long time since I've actually filmed a video and I have a pretty exciting one today. So actually starting next week on Wednesday, I will be teaching kindergarten. And what I'm going to be planning on doing is filming kind of like, I don't know how many parts there's gonna to be to this video series kind of thing about setting up my classroom. This is gonna be my first classroom ever. I'm so excited. If you couldn't guess what my theme is, I'm gonna give you three seconds to just assume what you think it probably is. Okay, and if you couldn't guess, it's Disney themed. And today it's Monday. It's a great way to start the week and the school is open. So my plan of action today is not really to bring everything there and set everything up. I'm going with some of the other kindergarten teachers and we're just gonna make layouts of kind of how we want our rooms to look. I have some stuff left over in the classroom from the other teacher that was there. So I think I'm gonna look through all of that to kind of figure out what I might wanna keep and what I might wanna put into the storage there. I'm seriously so excited. There's new floors. I just can't wait. So I hope you like this series. I'm really excited to share it, not only with you guys, but definitely so that way I can look back on this and maybe help it. Pardon my heart attack. Am I okay? And join me on my crazy journey of being a first year teacher. If I didn't already say this, I'm Kelly. I'm a first year kindergarten teacher. Let's go. So yeah, off to school we go. Um, I just have one bin of like games. I have my calendar set here, my like paper, bulletin board paper, some bins, games, um, like just random things here and there. And then in those shelves are like, or bins are different things that I can put up like voice levels. Um, name tags, all kinds of things like that. I just have both of my 10 drawers. I don't know if you can tell, but I can't speak. Oh, also wearing my uh, new shoes. I'm obsessed with them. Gonna hope that I can keep them very clean and white today. I love them. I've been going through this thing and I'm, I'm like, do I call it work or school? Like, okay, I'm gonna go ahead to, ahead to work or like, I'm gonna go ahead to school. I don't know, just things that my brain think about I'm unwell but yep I'm going to head there now and I'll see you when I get there all right I just pulled up I think I'm gonna go into the side entrance which is like our side over there but yeah I'm so excited and I'll let you know when I'm in Okay guys, so I'm in my room. I'm very happy. I got desks for my kiddos. I can't wait, I have 18. And let me tell you, I have the 18 desks laid out how the teacher put the, or the principal put them in here. And I still have so much space in my room. I'm gonna give you a quick tour. So as of right now, like the desks are literally all over there and I still have all of this space. And when I'm telling you all this space, this is insane. I could honestly, do a fat dance right here. <laughs> but this is what it just kind of looks like right now. Here's a rug that another kindergarten teacher gave me. I'm gonna put this out today. That'll be nice. I'm gonna put it over here. We have a Promethean board. I'm also gonna try to do those two bulletin boards. And then kind of the excess stuff that you see is what was left over from the other teacher, like all this stuff and in these shelving units. And we're gonna go through all those today, see what I want, walking around. I think I'm gonna put my teacher desk here, but I'm not positive yet. Again, here's just all the kiddos' desks. And then all these green shelves that go along the window with so much storage. Book bins, flag windows. I just can't believe how much room I have. It's kind of insane. <laughs> More stuff that has been left for me. Some bookshelves, whatnots. It, it's amazing. And I have two giant rectangle tables. One of them will be for small group. And I'm thinking to put it over there because I literally have so much space there. And then I was blessed to be left with this. Now I don't have to worry about buying it. Um, it that's really nice. And I'm really happy that I have that. And then these are like foldable walls, whatever you call them. There's another classroom on the side. And what I'm thinking of doing back here will be like my word wall, vowel valleys, sound wall, things like that, that we're gonna take down. That's from the other teacher. And then that bulletin board is going to be um, birthdays, I think. 
and then this one is going to be the calendar all that good stuff and i'm going to move those bins not really sure if i'm going to use them yet because i was lucky and well the desks are not all the same but i was lucky enough to get the desks so they're going to be putting their things in there so i'm not really sure on if i'm going to use that or not and then yeah all of this storage which is insane and i'm happy i have a sink but these are huge i am so happy that i have this because this is going to be put like i'm going to put things in here that like i don't really need to be seen whatnot but yeah and then all of these have things in it it is going to be great and i'll quickly show you the outside and they got new floors it was kind of carpet before and it was not the cutest thing and i'm very happy that we have it's like tile it's really cute And then on those bulletin boards, I'm going to be putting like my name and a cute little Disney display. So I'm going to go ahead and I think move some of the desks around and put the rug down. some stuff gonna go through it brought this bin brought all that now I have my tables or my desks and tables but they all need to get leveled obviously don't know what I'm doing with these yet but I'm gonna start to kind of slowly go through all of this okay so right now I think I'm gonna do this bulletin board I'm gonna try my best and I think this is gonna be the birthday bulletin board or the calendar I don't really know but I'm gonna do both of the paper and the borders now. update so here's my calendar board i still have to put velcro on all these and then i'm gonna velcro like the month all that stuff but it has the days of the week season the weather calendar and i just added some of the little decorations that come with it and then here on my whiteboard i'm gonna have our schedule and then this is my actual obsession this is my birthday one it is the cutest thing ever i love it it's kind of <laughs> slowly piecing things together i'm extremely overwhelmed and then we went down to the resource room and they gave us a bunch more um guided reading and some other kind of puzzles so i'm just gonna continue trudging along okay so i like got my door done with the little mickeys and it's gonna have their names on all of them And then this on its way. Then I have my Winnie the Pooh quote, you're braver than you believe, stronger than you seem, and smarter than you think. 
the rules. I have, I have my shapes, posters. Then I kind of just mix and match everything. This is like, I went through a bunch of the storage and this is what's left that like I don't want in here. It's not mine. That's gonna be schedule, balloons, birthdays. Those aren't really going there, but they're just there. Book bins I still have left to do, but they're all in their groups that I'm thinking, but it's coming together very slowly. I have a list of things I need to do tomorrow because there's a bunch, but I feel like this is a good day one, I'm trying not to get too overwhelmed. Oh, and then I can show you what's in here kind of. So I have like our math curriculum because I don't need them to have like access to all that. And I think it looks nice in there. This won't stick. Then in here is basically like literacy, but I think I might put their leveled readers like in those cabinets because there's so much space. But I have all that there. Some like worksheets that I can make copies of, do it out. More literacy stuff. Then this is like handwriting without tears, the curriculum. And then here's kind of the math manipulatives drawer. And then I haven't even gone through this. This is a bunch of books that they left. And then just like extra Kleenex and whatnot. Still need to organize this, figure out what I'm doing with these tables, find myself a teacher's desk. And then back here, those are just like some games. I need to go through all this stuff, start filling things in here. This is where I think I'm gonna keep more math manipulatives, I think. And just kind of slowly figure it all out. Okay, so I have my book bins now, and I'm gonna label them with my little numbers for their book bins, and I'm going to tape them on. Okay, so I just finished all my book bands and I'm obsessed. I think they look really good. I kind of like the rainbow, kind of matches that, but I think they look really good and I'm happy that I definitely got that done. All right, all, I'm officially heading home. Um, honestly, it, I've been here for like eight hours and I've got to eat today. So I kind of feel like I'm about to pass out and I figured, you know what? I worked really hard. I should probably go home. So thank you all for watching. I'm really happy with everything I got done today. Tomorrow's gonna be crazy. I have a lot more I need to bring. I'm gonna bring my speaker so I can remember to play my music and whatnot. I'm gonna bring food so I can actually eat lunch here and not dwindle away. I'm just kidding. But yeah, thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye.